rope. I don't know. That's what happened that. the last time we really saw Dance Mom star Abby Lee Miller. Now she was getting all emotional with a medium. Now I wonder if that medium actually saw this one coming. Abby has now been charged with money laundering. That's sickening. You are out. In a Pittsburgh federal court yesterday, Miller was charged with bringing into the country an amount of money in excess of $10,000 without reporting it. And that's a felony. No, nothing's worth that much money. This comes on the heels of 20 other counts that have been filed against Miller, including bankruptcy fraud and hiding over $700,000 in income stemming from her TV shows. And now Miller's lawyer says she will be pleading guilty to some of those chargers next week. Quote, accepting responsibility for mistakes I have made. Abby's legal difficulties actually started before Dance Moms ever went on the air when, in 2010, she originally filed for bankruptcy. As she told us later, her dance business had been struggling. I myself was in trouble. I mean, the whole economy was bad. People were losing their businesses. Children's dance tuition was the first thing to go. But then Miller's infamous Dance Mom confrontations begin airing and were spotted by the bankruptcy judge who was simply channel surfing at the time. He accused her of not disclosing money he felt was coming in, which led to that 20 count fraud indictment last October. Abby had told us she hadn't been doing that well. Everybody thinks, oh wow, she's probably booming. She probably has tons and tons of kids now. It's the opposite. Kids left because of the crew and stepping on their bags and pushing them out of the way. And now comes the new charge for money laundering. Well, you know what? The show must go on. Now, Abby will probably strike a deal when she pleads guilty because right now, she's facing five years in prison and a multi-million dollar penalty.